What is up guys, DJ Martini Midwest coming at you with another video for my channel today. I got a really cool little portable generator power pack, however you would like to call it. It's from Big Blue. Um, it's a 296 uh, watt hour uh, solar power generators, what they're calling it, uh, power station. Very, very cool, lots of options. Good price point, I think I did a lot of research on this, uh, looking for something around 300 watts. Uh, uh, and you know this was probably the best value I could find out there with good reviews as well so I just want to say thank you guys for tuning in it's DJ Martini Midwest DJ Martini Services on Facebook and DJ Martini Midwest.com check them all out guys if you like these type of videos this is a item review I do item reviews um, on different things DJ products tech uh, zingers every once in a while uh, just random stuff that I'll bring in that I purchase that I think it's interesting I want to bring it to you guys I do item reviews, so if you guys are interested in that, I just do it from an average consumer with a little bit of knowledge, uh, give you some positives, negatives, and you know a little bit more information on the item uh, in case you guys are interested in purchasing it. That way you guys have a little basic information. I'm always uh, purchasing stuff uh, that I can't really find a lot of videos on, so it kind of helps you guys. So uh, if you're interested in review video guys, please like, subscribe, DJ Martini Midwest and I can bring you some information, guys. So thank you guys so much. I try to do an honest review, uh, bring you positive and negatives, and just give you a little bit more information to help out. That's all I'm trying to do is help. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope everybody's doing okay, staying safe, staying strong, but keeping busy, guys. So all right, let's get into Big Blue here, guys. Uh, it, like I said, it is a 296 watt hour portable solar generator power station, 80,000 milliamps, uh, 110 volt slash 300 watt and it peaks at 600 watts but you know if you had that much power it'd probably shut down on you so um so let's get into it guys it weighs about six pounds it does have a lot of uh, options on it um with outlets and different things that i'll we'll get into in just a second um just gonna tell you what the 296 watt hour what does that mean uh so in a basic broke down layman's terms if you had a 100 watt light bulb and you were trying to use this unit to power that 100 watt, watt light bulb. It's 296, so you take that and you know divide it, blah, 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 and you're gonna get about three hours, so that's about kind of where we're at. So this would power your 100 watt light bulb for about three hours, so a little bit less, it's 296. So, uh, but that's kind of you know how the watt hour works. Um, just a little bit, layman's not super uh, technical okay guys I'm not gonna get super technical in all the voltage and everything this provides but it will uh, and like I said I did the research will provide power for you know bigger items and that's kind of the reason why I purchased it is so it could power like a TV a bigger TV it powered my 60 inch TV um, how long it's gonna do that for probably not that long probably maybe you know two hours uh, but it's going to power those items and that's kind of why I purchased it, I also purchased it so it could power an amplifier that's 300 watts. Um, so it's gonna power that amplifier for around you know two, three hours as well. So very, very cool depending on the volumes and stuff, but uh, that way it can have kind of a backup power unit for some systems that I might use. Or if I did an outdoor gig, uh, it might power uh, you know a little speaker for a while as well. So uh, those are the kind of reasons I purchased it but it was also a great value. So you pick this guy up, it'll be $259. Uh, there is a $50 coupon right now uh, on Amazon for this guy. And you know, that'll bring you around $200, which is a great value when you're looking for amps or you know, power packs like this for that you know, have 300 watts. Um, uh, very far and few, and you know, especially that have good reviews and stuff. And this one has pretty good reviews, so I did do a lot of research checking that out. I also like that it has a lot of outlets and inputs and things like that. So, another thing that's very important with this guy is that you can uh, solar charge it, you can use a 100 watt uh, solar charge panel, it is separate, you would have to buy that separate, but you can buy those. Uh, you could even buy like a 60 watt, you know whatever you can afford there um, and it will it charge it charge it up and I, I believe if you were to charge with a, um, a 100 watt solar panel it would take about six to seven hours which isn't that bad so if you were to use a, a 60 watt it would probably take more like 10 hours uh, probably a whole day to charge the pack but you know if that's in your your budget 
I would say it's a great idea to pick up even a 60 watt. Uh, that way you can charge this and, and be kind of off the power grid. You don't have to rely on plugging it into the wall because if your power goes out, um, you know, at least there's other methods to get this done. So very, very cool there. Uh, it can also be double charged. It has a USB type C uh, adapter with 100 watt. Uh, so you can not only uh, charge a USB C item, but you can input it in and take the power into the unit to charge it through USB type C because uh, a lot of the big power bricks now go uh, to USB C. So you can hook that up on the USB type C and plug it into the wall and charge this item super fast in two to three, two to three hours. So that's kind of a cool option with it as well when we're talking about charging. And then if you were just to plug it into the wall, the normal uh, charging cable, which is right here that you did get, uh, normal charging cable, that'll take about seven to eight hours as well. So takes a little bit to charge, but this thing does last a long time. So I've had it for almost a month now and I've just used it constantly to charge, you know, uh, tablets, uh, iPads, phones. Uh, I powered my TV with it for a little while uh, just to make sure it worked. Um, so uh, a speaker, I powered a speaker with it. Uh, I've, I've used it for many items and I have not charged this unit and it still shows that I have like, uh, I think it has five bars total and it still shows that I have four bars. So uh, very, very cool there uh, that it's still, you know, holding that much power. So very cool. I love that part of it. All right. So like I said, it weighs 6.6 .6 pounds, not that heavy, pretty portable guys. You can see this here. I'll bring it up uh, pretty portable little unit. Uh, like little rubber pads on the bottom this would be your input for charging if you were to charge it uh, through the wall or if you were to plug in your solar panel that's how you charge it there you got a fan on both sides um, if you're using an item that takes a lot of watts it will kick in and use the fan to cool itself down because it you know it will run some heat um, but so far that has worked really good and the fan it's, it's uh, I wouldn't say super loud, but it's definitely noticeable when the fan kicks in. Um, it does have this light on the back. Very, very bright, guys. So it's like a little emergency light. Um, nice little handle on top here, guys. So it, it's got a very, very nice build. Uh, and I love all the uh, options on the front, guys. So we're going to go over this real quick. Uh, but it does have USB. So you got two USB ports. You got one USB um, like 3.0 adapter with the high volt, which is 18 volts, and these are 10, sorry, 18 watts, and these are 10 watts. And then you have that USB type C port right there, like I said, so you can charge this and charge items as well. So not only can it be an input, it can be an output, which is kind of cool. You have a cigarette lighter adapter here, which is 12 volts, 10 amps, 120 watt. You can use there. But the coolest thing I thought was it's got four um, 110 volt, 300 watt AC uh, plugins, which was probably the biggest reason that I purchased this is because it has that many plugins, guys. It's got two with the ground plugs on them, so you have the you know the three prong, and two that are just normal, and very very helpful, guys. When you can plug into four things into this, so. That's pretty impressive. You usually won't find that. You'll maybe find one or two uh, and, and not like one or the other, not three prong, not three prong and two prong. So um, very, very impressive there, guys. So that was one of the big reasons why I purchased this it was because it had so many inputs here, guys. It also has um, the regular like plugins for your uh, DC type plugins. So you can plug in the two prongs to like uh, charge like a car battery. Um, you just need the adapters. It doesn't come with any adapters. I did purchase an adapter to plug into this so I can plug into like a car, uh, things like that. Uh, but I haven't received them yet, but that's kind of what these are. Uh, they just have a little circle prongs you plug in and then you can plug them on charge like car batteries, motorcycle batteries, that type of thing. So very, very cool there. Uh, when you buy it, all you're going to do is get the item itself and the AC plug, a little book of instructions, and that's really all you're going to get. But there is so many accessories that you can buy with this. It's very, very cool there. So I'm going to show you some basic operation with the Big Blue. 
there is a couple of taps and pushes and stuff that you have to do to get this uh, item to work for you. Uh, so I kind of show you, hopefully that'll help, help you guys if you're trying to figure it out. It took me a minute to figure it out, um, but we'll kind of go through it really quick. So I'm going to go ahead and shut this down and show you everything. Okay. So, so if you have the item here and say you want to turn it on, so you're going to go ahead and turn it on. It's a hard push and hold and it turns on. Okay. Say you want to turn your AC uh, plugins on. So you're going to want to hold push and hold and then that's going to turn on now if you want to shut it off same thing push and hold and it shuts it off okay uh, dc is kind of a quick tap there you go quick tap turns all your days dc on and then you know quick tap to turn that off uh, if you want to turn usb on all you gotta do is plug something into those and they'll automatically turn on the lights on the back uh it's a press and hold to turn on initially and then it's a quick tap to change the modes you can see it has SOS and it also has like a strobe and then that's off so kind of different on the different approaches for the tapping and everything but everything uh, works there and then if you want to shut the item off all you do is hold and it shuts off okay guys so that's pretty much it there guys uh, but I wanted to show you that because it kind of is, you know, a quick hold and it's kind of frustrating when I was trying to turn things on and it w just wouldn't do it. Uh, and and you, you actually have to turn, you know, hit those buttons for them to work to be able to charge your items. Okay. Now, when things are on, you can use multiple things at the same time. So if you want to charge, you know, an AC item or power an AC item, but charge your phone at the same time, you can definitely do that. Everything works at the same time. So that's very possible uh, there. Um, so to answer that question. So let's kind of finish this up, guys. Uh, I think I got everything, uh, information that I wanted to get out to you. Hopefully you guys are helped out by this. But let's go over positives, guys. Positives, guys, is it's a value, guys, at $250. Uh, with that coupon, make it around $200. That's a really good value when you're talking about a 300 watt um, portable power pack generator, however you want to call this. You're not going to find that. I did the research, guys. I looked for, you know, 300 watt items, and you know, for that price point, you're easily going to pay $300 plus. And so this was a great value finding this. Also, with all the uh, outputs and in ports and everything, it was a great value. You know, having four. Um, AC plugins that was huge guys uh, you're not going to find that on a lot of other uh, portable power stations unless you get really expensive and start paying you know five six hundred dollars for them uh, so it's also very light 6.6 .6 pounds very portable very small this is not very big whatsoever uh, so very very cool there being portable price point is right like I said uh, 300 watt it's worked very sufficiently for me so far like I said I've had it for about a month and everything is working very very good all the ports and everything the light is very nice uh, so everything is good to go there guys uh, negatives let's talk about negatives a little bit guys the fan noise I know that's gonna bother some people it does not bother me I don't think it's excessively loud but you can definitely notice it when it's on so that might bother some people out there the fan noise also, I think uh, some things that are going to bother some people is the push buttons. It's just kind of a uh, weird, uh, some you have to hold for them to work right. Some is a quick tap. Um, so I wish that was just kind of weird to me, uh, how they set that up. If you push the button, it should just turn on. It shouldn't have to be like a hold or a quick tap or that type of thing. And if you, if you try to like do a quick tap on some of them, it's just not going to work. So like I said, it was kind of a little frustrating at first trying to learn how to use this. Um, but like I said, hopefully with this video that will help some people figure out how to use it faster. So, uh, so that's going to be a negative in my, my opinion. And, um, I think that's about it guys. I don't have too many negatives on this. I really do like it. Actually, it's working really good for me. Um, the handle is nice as well. Uh, construction is good. I like that it can be charged with a solar panel. Um, you can easily charge it, like I said, uh, with solar panel, and I kind of talked about the charging times. So that is a positive as well. And um, like I said, I think Big Blue is a keeper for me. I'm gonna hold on to this. It's gonna be able to be very useful, not only in my DJ career, but for my home use. Um, if I need to charge a battery, if we have a power outage and I need to power something for a little bit, it's gonna be there for me. So. 
I do like that peace of mind of having at least something. Not only can I charge it with power, but I can charge it with solar power and it's going to be able to, you know, power some items for me. Maybe not everything I need, but it's going to be able to power uh, some items I need temporarily for a little bit. So very, very cool there. Uh, if you don't buy it for uh, a necessity, guys, I think it's a great uh, backup safety item, guys, just in case. Uh, even, you know, it has a light too, guys. It's very handy. Uh, so uh, just a kind of a peace of mind item that, you know, we got, you know, you know, taxes out there. We got uh, a little uh, um, uh, money from the government this year with some stimulus. So just some something a peace of mind that you guys might want to invest in because it is an investment is a little battery portable battery pack like this uh, for a shady time that you might need it and you might have to charge some items guys so very cool the big blue i would definitely recommend this uh, item uh, so check it out if you guys want to see the link i will leave a link in the description for this item um, if you want to pick it up, it would help my channel uh, if you use my link. So thank you guys so much. Please like, subscribe, and share if you guys like review videos like this. I will have more coming, um, and especially with the more subscribers, likes, positive feedback from you guys, I will continue making video guys, videos for you guys. So thank you guys so much. It's been DJ Martini Midwest. DJ Martini Services on Facebook and DJMartiniMidwest.com. Check them all out, guys, and thank you guys so much. This has been Big Blue, the portable solar generator power pack. Thank you guys so much. We'll talk to you guys later.